In an earlier video, we showed how radon and other soil gases can enter a home through the stack effect, wind, and hydrostatic pressure. With this video, we'd like to show a home building technique used to work with these forces and divert radon and other soil gases before they enter the home. That technique is known as soil depressurization. It is accomplished by adding a pipe during the building process that connects the soil under the house out through the roof. The pipe relies on the gravel bed below the slab to draw air in from the edges. If you're building new, it's recommended to add a channeling device such as ground air manager to the gravel bed to improve flow and performance of the system. As air collects in the vent pipe leading through the roof, it becomes heated as it goes through the heated space of the house. This air naturally wants to rise, and as it does so, it creates a stack effect within the pipe. Wind, as it travels across the top of the pipe, creates a low pressure zone at that location, additionally drawing air up the pipe. With these forces acting on the channel created, gases can be drawn up from below the house and the soil becomes depressurized. Radon and other soil gases now have a way of working their way up to the surface without going through the living space of the home. A system like this is known as a passive soil depressurization system or PSD. Systems like this have been installed in homes for decades and they have proven to significantly reduce radon and soil gas infiltration in the home. Sometimes a passive system isn't enough to sufficiently eliminate radon and soil gas entry. In these cases, a fan is needed. The fan is typically installed in the attic and depending on its size, it can draw a large volume of air up the pipe. A system like this is known as an active soil depressurization system, or ASD. With the exception of extreme cases, an active soil depressurization system has been shown over the years to reduce radon and soil gas infiltration in a home to safe levels. It has also been shown to reduce moisture levels in a home. A study recently published by the EPA documents basement moisture level reductions in the air, walls, and floor on homes that had soil depressurization systems installed. If you're building new, it is highly recommended to add a soil depressurization system to the home. It is easy and inexpensive to install during the building phase, and there are many benefits gained from the system.